What's up, JL Nation? Reacts. So today, y'all, I come to you all with a Beyonce Renaissance tour. Reacts. And I'm giving you all my final thoughts and my final opinions of what I've seen so far. What's going on with the tour and stuff. So, y'all, I'm not going to talk too long. Let's get us out of this video. Period. <laughs> As some of y'all may know, y'all, Beyonce is currently on Renaissance tour, and it's a lot of stuff going on. People talking about a lot of things, which I'm gonna get to inside of the video. So, um, from what I've seen so far, Beyonce is giving it all she's got. She's touring, she's putting on a great performance, and she even got people crying in the tour. <laughs> So that's shocking to have people crying. So I mean, if you got to cry, that mean it got to be good. So, hey, that's that's what I'm seeing so far. So yeah, Beyonce's tour dates as follows. Let's go and pull up her tour dates. I'm gonna show y'all. So for what I'm seeing, y'all, Beyonce is gonna be touring from Wednesday, May 10th, 2023, to September 27th, 2023. So she's currently on tour right now. And I think she, by the time y'all see this video, she's done with her first state, so she's going to her second state. So yeah, Beyonce is gonna be touring for a long time, so she's nowhere near done. And so I give her props, I give her my, I send my prayers. Hopefully she gets through it great, because that's a lot. I mean, because each concert is about three hours, I think. I might be wrong, but I think it's about three hours, if I'm not mistaken. And with these concerts, she's not only giving Renaissance, but she's giving her other stuff too. She's singing other songs too as well. So she's not only doing Renaissance, but she's including all her old stuff inside this tour as well. So yeah, so yeah, I yeah pray for Beyonce, wish her good luck because she's going to need it because she's got a lot of tour dates coming up. So, but I know she can do it. She's gonna make her money. She's gonna continue to put on the performance. So yeah, so yeah, let's go into these outfits. So yeah, Beyonce showed up and showed out with a lot of outfits. I mean, this is this. I think this is one of the biggest concerts she ever did. They have multiple outfits in it. So yeah, I'm gonna go over each outfit. I want to talk about each outfit, and I want y'all opinions in the comments of which outfit was the best for y'all, and you know which outfit you like. So first, y'all we're gonna go with Beyonce's black jumpsuit. Now that was nice. She looked clean in it. I like the I like the sparkles in it, the glitter. It just gives me, and I think this is the one. I think this is the outfit that she sung her son. I guess that son that makes people cry. I forgot the name of that song. <laughs> Yeah, that song was called Flowers and Eyes by Beyonce. And I think they made people cry a lot. And they were shocked to include that inside the Renaissance tour. This outfit right here, I get this a 10 out of 10 because I enjoy it. I like the way it looks. It's gray, it's a nice jumpsuit. So yeah, it's, she kept it plain and simple. That's good, I like it. Oh baby, you won't break my soul. This was one of the outfits that I love. Uh, I think she performed, break, from what I seen on TikTok, I'm gonna show y'all a little clip it. She performed Break My Soul in this outfit. And y'all, Beyonce looked pretty fine. <laughs> <laughs> but this is giving me like a nice rainbowish, nice goldish color of 
Uh, just, it's just very nice. It, it goes with Renaissance. The way everything flows from the from the boots and stuff. Everything just goes with Renaissance. It's beautiful. Beyonce look beautiful. And, and yeah, all, all, when the queen comes, she's going to look beautiful. And there's nothing that she wears that's going to make me be like, oh, oh, ah. No. I like this outfit. I get it a 10 out of 10. She need to wear this again. So, and this one, she came as a B. So y'all know this is Queen B, so she had to put on her B, and we, I guess we're the high. So she's the Queen B, and we're the high. So I don't know what son she performed in this, but uh, it's giving Queen B. And I like it because she's a B. She, you know, she's showing us that she's Queen B and it just looked good. I mean, I was shocked from the outfit change that was inside of this Rihanna Renaissance, Renaissance tour. I didn't know she was gonna put all uh, this inside the Renaissance tour. I thought it was gonna be just like just a regular concert. But apparently I was wrong. Beyonce showed up and showed out, especially with all these outfits. So I give this outfit right here, this B outfit, a 10 out of 10. She need to wear this again. Okay, so this outfit right here was beautiful and interesting and weird at the same time because this was like a, a regular jumpsuit outfit, but the funny part about it is her hint, the, her gloves that she has on, it was actually wrapped around the outfit. So at first when I was looking at it, I, I was kind of confused of which was her real hand. Like, it was kind of weird, especially like looking at it on the phone, but as you look closer, you can see that her real hand is like to the right and like, it's just the fake hands on the, on the outfit. Now you can tell this is totally different. As 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 usual, Beyonce is gonna come out different. I've never seen an outfit like that before. Like where your hands, your actual arm is wrapped around the outfit, that's different. And it's different in a good way. So I guess Beyonce wanted her fans to know that this Renaissance tour is gonna be different. They're gonna get their money worth. And yeah, it's, you can, I, I don't have anything negative to say about it. Even though some people did in the comments, which I will discuss later. So far, I don't have anything negative to say bad about the Beyonce tour. Now this outfit right here was a, sim a simple outfit. It was different because they had like a mirror thing in front of the, in front of her top, which is totally different. And she brought it out with some high boots. And that was beautiful. I don't see anything, I don't see anything wrong with it. Beyonce looked like a nice diva up there <laughs> performing. And I'm pretty sure a lot of people enjoyed it. As usual, the out this outfit was actually nice to me. I found it very, she looked fine in it. I'm gonna say that, Be yeah, she looked fine in it. That's all I'm gonna say. She looked the good in it. I get this outfit a 10 out of 10. She need to wear this again, which I know she ain't gonna wear it again, but I would like to see her wear it again. Um, yeah. This outfit right here gave me like a, 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 a like a tomboyish outfit. How she had the nice jump pants and the boots. And it was just different. I think this, I think on this is she was singing. What's it? Um. Uh,
the 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 uh top was different how it had like the metal piece to it to cover up the chest that was different the pants was nice i like the shoes this was totally different and this really brought out renaissance like because if you look at her album it's basically like a sparklish album so to me this really brought out the renaissance album and all her outfits was based on renaissance it was based on renaissance and she i i give her kudos for that i give all her i give all her outfits tens all the outfits deserve tens nothing was bad nothing was ugly everything was just perfect period so y'all with these performances y'all for what i'm seeing online beyonce is doing good i feel like there's nothing negative to say about it now that's me that's my opinion but from what i'm seeing online beyonce is giving she's serving she's giving all she's got now you got some fools out there that's in the comments saying that Beyonce had a surgery, which I would go over some of these comments for you all, because me personally, I didn't know that Beyonce had a foot surgery. They said it's a foot surgery, so I didn't know she had a surgery. Some people saying that her performance is, is not as good as the other one used to be. So let's, I'm not gonna talk too long. Let's go over some of these comments, these negative comments. So you can see that somebody chimed in in one of the videos in the comments, and they was like, I can feel she hasn't fully healed from her surgery. She doesn't walk and dance as hard as before. So when I seen that, I was like, Beyonce had a surgery? I was like, what kind of surgery she had? Because I didn't know she had a surgery. So I continue to read the comments and somebody said that she had a foot surgery. And then so another person chimed in that was like, right, she's definitely taking it a little bit easier. She's still serving though. And then other people was like, what surgery she had? What surgery? And then a fan had chimed in and said, Foot surgery so everybody like oh she had a foot surgery so i was like oh well maybe that's why she's you know to me she giving it to me i i'm just giving it to me so i don't i don't i don't see anything but i guess that's what people saying that you know she had foot surgery so she's not dancing as good as she used to do before somebody said a fan was defending beyonce and they was like she's not as young as she used to be it's not that hard to understand why aging is a drama these days. So I'm guessing they had they didn't type it correctly. So I, I guess they were saying that she's not as old as she young as she used to be. So aging is part of life. So there shouldn't be no reason why people is talking about Beyonce like this. What is true? Um, as you get older, you can't do some of the things you used to do, which is understandable. I mean, she was younger back then, but still. From what I seen, Beyonce was not um, performing lame. She wasn't performing bad. She was giving people their money worth. If you can have somebody crying, that mean you was good. So that's those were some of the negative thoughts. And then one person had said, uh, <laughs> I laughed at this one. Somebody had said, be granny, too old. She not even doing much dancing. Why? And Janet Jackson 60 and killed it on stage. I wasn't there to see the performance, but what I seen online, Beyonce was dancing good. Now, I ain't gonna lie. Janet Jackson, I was moving on stage for her age now. I was like, okay, Janet Jackson. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. But still, what I seen so far, Beyonce was not giving nobody trash. It like she was, from what I seen, it like she worked hard on the concert. Everything was nice. Everything was beautiful. So I don't have anything negative to say bad about it. And then you had a lot of people that was saying that she didn't enjoy the performance. Somebody was like, she is giving us face, body, and most importantly, vocals. Period. And that's what I'm talking about. You got to uplift people. Like, because if, you, if you're talking about people in the com Beyonce probably seen these comments. Nobody ain't want to do nothing for y'all no more because y'all speaking so negatively about her. But it's good to have, see some people, you know, giving their comments and thoughts on it. And like somebody said, she's giving legs and hips and body. Yada, yada. Yeah. Then somebody else said, her voice never fails her. She sounds as beautiful as ever. Hope she heals soon. So it... I guess her foot surgery is, you know, stopping her and people is noticing it, but still it's not, it wasn't, it's not trash. It's not trash. 
I enjoyed this one, what I'm seeing, and a lot of other people enjoyed it as well. Somebody else said, I love on top of... Somebody said, I like Love on Top in this key, and I like how she incorporated her original choreography for Crazy in Love. So, yeah, Beyonce, like I said before, Beyonce is not only performing Renaissance, but she's giving people a deluxe package. She's performing Crazy in Love, Love on Top, all these older songs. So, I mean, why complain? Like, y'all paid money, and she's giving y'all a lot of stuff. So, there's no need to complain about the queen. She doing good. She she might be not not be dancing her best as some of y'all said, not me. But at least she's giving y'all money worth with all the designs and stuff and the the performances, the dance, the background dances look good. So y'all get off Beyonce, leave her alone. You know, let her be. She's doing the best she can. Y'all gotta think about it. She's on tour and she got a lot of more tours to go. So I mean, of course she's gonna be tired, but she, to me she's giving all she got. All right, so y'all, let me tell y'all my final thoughts on this, on everything. So, for me, I enjoyed the performances. From what I've seen so far online, the people putting it out and leaking it, the performances was great. Beyonce is not giving out trash. She's not putting out trash. It looked like that she's been working on this, this tour for a long time now. And so, of course, you can have people in the comments that are all going to have something negative to say. That's with everything. But from what I'm seeing so far, it's excellent. And I want mine going to pay my, I want mine going to buy the Beyonce ticket, but I can't because I already tried and I wasn't going to be in the back. And I do not want to be in the back. If I'm going to the performance, I need to be up front so I can at least smell when she twirl. I can at least catch a piece of string or half or something. Because I, I can't sit in the back. I can't. So I would not be going, but I would be watching it online when it come on HBO Max or whatever. But y'all, hopefully you all enjoyed this video. Hopefully you all just bought the ticket, y'all enjoy the performance. Y'all keep on with the comments, because I'm looking, y'all. I'm giving y'all some more information on this, y'all. So, you know, if y'all want a part two to this, if y'all want me to react to more of this stuff, y'all like, comment, subscribe. Tell me in the comments below what was your favorite outfit. Tell me what was your favorite, your favorite performance so far if you went. And if you didn't, go tell me what was your favorite performance from what you've seen online as well. Y'all, Beyonce is going to be going on a tour starting, I guess, tomorrow, I believe. She got a long way to go, y'all. Y'all keep the queen lifted up in prayer because she gonna need it. Especially looking at some of y'all comments. Yeah, y'all comments. So I'm not gonna talk too long, y'all. If y'all enjoyed the video, like, comment, subscribe. I'm gonna be digging deeper for some more information, some more tea for y'all. And yeah, catch y'all in the next video. Peace out. JL Nation reacts. I'm out. Y'all be blessed. Peace, love, tag, grease. See y'all later.